This is a reply video. I, I keep getting people that tell me AMC is dead, no one's buying AMC, no one's holding AMC. And this is not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor, so based on anything I say off these videos, I just do it for pure entertainment purposes only. But a judge from Delaware, a legal statement saying that there was 3.8 million shareholders of AMC. That's all I gotta tell you. 3.8 million retail holders. Now, let's just say only 1 million of us are buying, buying, buying. And let's say 2 million of us are holding. And you say the squeeze is over and we can't happen. It's not gonna happen. Well, if there's that many of us and we're still buying shares, then guess what? It's just going to squeeze again. So, I don't know, man. There's really no argument for me because even let's say that that day when it hit 72 bucks, that was the squeeze. Okay? It dropped. Now there's, it's been over, well, it's been over a year, right? Two years since that happened. So, it was bound to squeeze again. I'm just saying. That's what happens when you put pressure on this shit. Um, so, quit coming at me with dumb shit, because <laughs> I may have a smooth brain, but I know what they fucking said, 3.8 million retail shareholders, um, and that would mean that we only have like an average of 135 shares or some shit like that. I have way more than 135 shares. Honestly, I know like maybe two people that have less than that, and it's just like little grandmas that their grandsons told them to buy them, and they got like 10 shares, you know what I mean, just sitting there, so, I mean... The majority of us definitely are probably in the 500, 300, 500 range to 1,000. And then you got dudes that are just ignorant with like 10 grand, 10,000 shares. So, I don't know, man. Just just keep that in mind every time you start wondering, damn, is this thing dead? Is it over? Is it really dead? 3.8 million shareholders. And that's a fact.